Hi guys, this is ISIS Tech Support, and uh, I figured I'd show you a really cool program that has come in handy many, many times. Uh, you can look in Google and type Astra32, or you can just go to astra32.com. Um, and this program was more helpful back when it was Windows 98 and drivers were horribly hard to find um, but even now you'll uh, sometimes come up uh, you'll have something you don't know exactly what the model is and don't know how to find out this makes it really easy go over here to download and get the self installer go ahead and save it or you can open it depends on uh, your preference I tend to save my files in case I need to reinstall them or give them to someone else okay and it's gonna come up and uh, ask you to launch Astro 32 go to continue and it's going to load up. Um, what it's basically doing is scanning the uh, peripherals and uh, finding out what all your devices are. I don't think I have ever had any system that this didn't tell me what driver in that system was. And uh, as you see, you have here down the side your motherboard. And by the way, this tells you what your driver is, whether the driver is installed or not. So when you need to find out what it is to install the driver, not just what it is when the driver is installed. Um, it's got your CPU information, BIOS information, your PCI and AGP devices. you got your memory modules tells you what memory you're using your storage tells you what hard drives what USB devices you have what printers you have your network card and information the monitors attached to your system the video card and even gives you the version of Windows um, and installed programs and hotfixes. It's really cool. Uh, sometimes you won't know um, what DirectX your system is using or uh, what the Internet Explorer version is, the exact version, um, where Windows is installed, um, what operating system you have and what version of that operating system you have so it's it's an all-around really cool program that pretty much uh, tells you everything you need to know so if you can't find what drivers you need with this program you might not be able to find them 